Oh my God! Can you believe we are at a subway station now? Hi guys, this is Daisy, and welcome to my channel. Today I want to share Shanghai subway art with you. Here are the seven most impressive metro stations. Our first station is Danyang Road. Through a virtual contrast of black and white, the space represents the story of modern Chinese industrial civilization. The numbers and the Chinese characters here represent the time when these factories were built. For example, Yang Shupu Water Works was built in 1883. This black and white toilet is very lovely. Here we are, Changyi Road. At the moment we arrived here, I was attracted to the view immediately. There are four tree-shaped symmetrical pillars in the center of the station with branch-shaped light stripes. As the Chinese saying goes, 火树银花不夜天, which means fiery trees and silvery flowers shine on the bright night sky. That's exactly what I see. Oh my gosh, in Lu Jiazui Station, this artwork named Gold Waves is played on a joint LED electronic screen that's over 100 meters long. This work of art is mainly composed of two elements, gold and water. In this busy financial center, Lu Jiazui, of course, this image also expresses a study's dream of vitality and innovation. This may be a familiar metro station for foreigners, Yuyuan Garden Station, located near the Chenghuang Miao and the Bang. Since there were so many people in the station, we had to move to a small area to make this video. This area is a landmark in Shanghai, which combines the East and the West, historical and contemporary styles. You can see this water wave ceiling visualizes the illusion of Huangpu River above the metro line. And this wave slap onto the columns, creating a rhythmic position with changing lights. If the subway is compared to the artery of the city of Shanghai, then this remarkable station it is as if you can feel the pulse of the city. Do you want to see stars in the subway station? Let me show you. This eye-catching ceiling at the International Cruise Terminal Station showed us the 12 zodiacal constellation and the surrounding stars. Over 10,000 LEDs make up the night sky. You may find your constellation here. This may be the Cancer. I can't tell what this. And you see, this night sky is pretty long. The next station is Guilin Park. I like these bright green and flower shaped lamps here. So cute. And there are so many of these. And this is the art mural called Ancient Rhythm and New Fragrance with an attic flavor. It looks like a painting carved from steel. I just couldn't help touching it. There are traditional Chinese paintings with Osmethus flowers and butterflies. This beautiful calligraphy is an ancient poem about Osmethus' fragrance. Our last station, Wuzhong Road, reminds me of a futuristic world. Oh my god, can you believe we are at a subway station now? As you can see, there are no huge pillars in the station hall. So it looks spacious and unblocked. The curved ceiling and walls with shining lights make me feel like entering an immersive area. 
I'm a bit curious about the sparkling sea of lights and groups of buildings. Look closer, it's LED lights in different colors and diverse shapes of steel. If you pay attention here, you may see the famous tourist attraction, the Oriental Pearl Tower. Now it's the end of my vlog. Hope you are interested in Shanghai Subway Art. Which station is your favorite?